GTC. I mean, these are called GTCs, so yes. touch controllers. Okay. Left GTC is responsible for PFD. Middle is from MFD, and the right is responsible for NAVCOM. Okay. So what we will start from, we will start from going through initialization on an MFD screen. So you, you see database set status uh, on, the, on the middle one, middle. Oh, here. Database, database status. status. Click that. You see that everything is up to date almost. Okay, okay let's let, say it let is. me just check if this works. Somehow I have the feeling it doesn't. Ah, Jesus. Electronics. Now it does. Okay. Okay. So uh, we accept this. We click the next. Uh, next. Uh -huh. Okay. And now we will have different pages, so we click uh, that we've read it, next, on the bottom. Next. Once more. And just one more. Okay. Then we click next on the uh, upper corner, back, yeah, next, good. And here we are going through a different pre-flight test on the ground. So you please press pre-flight test. Now this, the plane is checking whether different warning systems are okay. So it was the the system that was uh, check the part was checking whether the engine uh, sorry fire engine fire uh, sensors are correct. And uh, stall warner was tested, and oxygen okay. system it's all done. We can click next. Next. Then we can click fuel or fuel on board sync, FOB sync. Okay, and we confirm that. Confirm. Good. Uh, we click next. And now uh, we are at the uh, loading page. So uh, we can click, click aircraft loading. Aircraft loading. Okay, and here you have to press uh, different positions. Okay, pilot. So let's say your pilot weight and your passenger on the left seat weight. You can put, unfortunately, 95 kilograms. Yep, 95. Uh -huh, okay, enter. Uh, so this is pilot and passenger left. Passenger left? Yeah, same thing. Like. Okay, ah, you were, that's uh, you, okay. okay. <laughs> Okay. And enter. enter. Good. So uh, now uh, the co-pilot. Uh, well, there is no co-pilot here. So if if you will have one, you can do that. Okay. You can scroll down to check whether. Oh, we have aft baggage 50 kilograms. So maybe we have only 10. Okay. Yeah. So. And I should not take the co-pilot out. No. Uh, yeah, okay. you should you should take a pilot out if there was one. Zero zero. Yeah. Okay. So uh, we are uh, on on the on the right side. Can you just please for me just check the angle of view when I'm looking uh, in a normal way because when I look down it looks different. Is okay. that okay? Yeah, when you look normally, that's is that a good like is that a good picture? Looks looks, looks okay. Okay. In my opinion. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, so uh, now we click uh, next. Uh, next here. Okay. Okay. And we have to make a definition of where we are going. First of all, uh, let's uh, add destination. Destination. And let's say our destination K will be K J F K. JFK, <laughs> why not? Okay. Sure. K J F K. Okay. Enter. Enter. But as a as a new part, as a new system, we have here also the system that is called SurfWatch. Okay. And SurfWatch is uh, monitoring 
the runway or taxiways when which are using it's an extension of a safe taxi system so you have we you have that your origin is kilo lima golf alpha but you have to select runway so you have to click on the origin origin yeah. runway and you can click zero four. runway zero four yeah and please look what ha what happens now Here. on the synthetic vision there is such a blue frame okay yeah and this blue frame this blue glow means that you are on the runway that is correct one you mean this blue? yeah yeah okay yeah. and also these chevrons yes in the middle the point they, they say that you are where you should be okay, okay. you can click next uh, okay that what we will leave however uh, yeah we can also put what is the required uh, takeoff distance and when you look on the right side aircraft status okay takeoff distance to 50 feet obstacle is 2591 feet right so actually you can put to require takeoff distance that value okay I type that in 2591 yeah, enter so now the system will be additional monitoring why, why doesn't it, it cannot transfer this here because you have to do that consciously oh, okay. and uh, confirm uh, yes okay that uh, it's, yes. it's uh, what you want okay. uh, you can also have a look on the runway so it was origin and click runway and you have information what is uh, takeoff run available from that point okay runway heading what is the gradient okay. all the data about yes. the runway when you are okay so you can press init now init button here yep in it and accept initialization and all the foreplay is done okay. okay so we put all the data okay now without any specific procedures uh, we are not going through the checklist mm -hmm. but on the left side you have uh, sorry on the left side uh -oh, sorry that must be uh, on the left side you have a knob can you see that knob here, uh, yeah. off run to the off and run to uh, run. Okay. Okay. Now, now we have some light. What? This is how you start the engine now. Exactly. Really? And and now you have to press that button okay. that is up over it. Can you see? Yeah. Just press that button. And that starts the engine. Yeah. Just <laughs> okay. Uh, but you have to press press it firmly. No? Is it frozen? Frozen? No. What's going on? Oh, I have to put it on run first. Yeah, you have to put it on the run. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's and then now turn and press the button. And here our turbine is starting. Is the sound comparable to the real airplane? No. Or is different? Okay. Okay. So we have a set of uh, different messages. Um, and now we have to switch on a couple of things on the bolster panel. First, we have to switch on the generators. Generator one and two. Yeah, correct. Okay. Uh, no so strobe lights. Get, yeah. Master oxygen, oxygen on. Master oxygen uh, on. Probe heat on. Probe heat on. Okay. And bleed on. Bleed, bleed, bleed. Air Where on. is it? Uh, there should be uh, another button for bleed, marked as bleed, I believe. No. No? Uh uh. Actually, I don't see it. Uh, the, the fresh air oh, bleed fresh. on the other side. Yeah. Oh, okay, fresh air. Okay, good. So. There are no cast messages. We can set altitude 3,000 feet. Altitude selector is here. Where do I see it? Where it's uh, yeah. okay there. The 3,000. Yeah. Altitude set. Very good. So now here on that engine part, you can see uh, that your flaps are up and, uh, below the you know uh, here uh, on the engine page. Yeah. Oh, on the engine page. Yeah. You have three green landing gear. Yep. Under this, you have flaps yes, okay. at uh, up position. Yes. So flaps are same position. You said 50%. 50%. Yep. 
percent set. On the right side, though, you have pitch trim. trim and roll trim, and pitch trim must go up to the takeoff position. Yep. Look okay. at here you can also manipulate pitch trim with this. Oh, this is great. Okay. I w I'd love to have that too. Okay. Okay. Good. So we said we said all this. Uh, it would be nice to have a proper frequency of uh, LaGuardia Tower. Okay. We have no idea what is the frequency, okay. but for this we have a NAVCOM. Please click Find. Find. Yeah, and click uh, Nearest. Nearest, LaGuardia. Uh, multiple. Multiple. Uh, scroll it down, down to, to Tower. Yep. Press tower. this. And flip. So press. Uh, Where is it? Uh, it's 118 decimal seven, and and let's press this active frequency 119 decimal seven five zero. Just press it. I mean this active one. Yeah. This one? Yeah. There we go. Oh, it's on standby and, now. And you no, know, it's this uh, 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 118 decimal seven. Oh, that's that the frequency. Set is the frequency. If you look at the right corner, okay, you can one. see Laguardia Tower. Okay. It's identifying it. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. So, uh, when we will rotate, uh, we, we have a toga button. So, you see, five degrees up. When, five degrees, okay. Yeah, when we will reach a rotation speed of 90. 90. 90 knots. And? Uh, gently up. Climb is? And uh, you will be climbing uh, straight ahead initially. What speed? Uh, well, uh, it will the speed will be accelerating pretty fast. Okay. So uh, when we will have positive rate, we will retract gear, okay. gear up. Yes, sure. And then uh, we will uh, retract flaps when above 115 knots. 115. Yes. And the best rate of climb is? Uh, the best rate of climb is 150. Okay. We will be, for the time being, okay. we will be climbing 90, only to 90, 115, 150. Yeah. And the idea is that after departure straight ahead, we will turn the right, uh, turn left to fly around uh, along Hudson River. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Can we do that? <laughs> yeah, we, we okay. will fly along Hudson River, and then just Salenberger approach. Salenberger approach, <laughs> and just at the end of this, we will turn left to JFK. So we will not go like it's it is showing us yes, to the sure. left. Okay. We will fly around. I fly around Manhattan here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I know the area very well. Very good. So enjoy your flight. Clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff. Runway four. Yeah. I, I don't need to talk to up. You talk us already on, you have to set it full forward. Positive rate, gear up. Gear up. Flaps up. Uh, when, oh when, no. when they are clear. That's the prison down there. Yeah. Three green. Yeah. Up. Very good. And you may continue climbing. And then we will make turn left. My first takeoff at LaGuardia. Climb to 1,000 feet or 1,500, maybe. Okay. So now, as we are at that position, we will be taking power back. To how much? Uh, yeah, up to 50 will be should be okay. Where? Uh, Where do I look? Uh, okay, that's that's okay. You have okay. percent of power oh, here. There. Okay, and you may put the nose down, and we can actually stay to have nicer views. Okay, all right. So now you may turn left. Uh, 
Uh, let me switch off the flight director according to our rules. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, we are still climbing a little bit. So maybe a little bit of a pitch trim. George Washington Bridge, that's yeah. almost the track Captain Sullenberger flew. Mm -hmm. I just wrote a long story for my latest book about it. The control forces are they real or realistic yeah, or yeah, yes? Yeah, it's heavy, isn't it? Yeah, it's and well, unex I, I thought it's lighter first, so the rotation I had to use more power strength than I thought. But mm -hmm. okay, you get used to that quickly. Yeah, you have uh, to remember you have three tones. Yeah. In your head, yeah. Yeah. I always wanted to fly this route and I <laughs> There we go. 